Yesterday was really great actually. It started um, in the morning with lean coffee again and I'm always surprised how talking about a, a topic for seven minutes and um, going through the, the whole idea of lean coffee can actually generate so many ideas. I had a chance to talk with all of people during the night, the day, today. Um, had a really nice key keynotes, which are very inspiring. And from what I have heard in other people, it's also they find very inspiring and motivated. When Agile, you say, was invented, I'm not sure it's the right term because um, I think they're very clear in the Agile Manifesto that we're discovering new ways. I tried to get people to to talk to me to say, what are they looking for in a conference? What are they trying to do? It's a little harder than you would anticipate. I constantly meet people and everybody that I met is a new connection. And it's somebody that I really feel comfortable contacting again. The other thing that I did during the day was I actually spent the afternoon at Lightning Talks. I was going to just go for the first session and I was so impressed with the caliber of these new speakers. I would like to make better debriefing after the escape room so people who are, will, who, the teams who will do escape room actually realize how they can do it better. I do believe in mutual admiration from time to time and positive reinforcement. You know, both uh, intrinsic and extrinsic rewards work beautifully. But I've learned more from adversaries, so-called nemesises, and people that I at first thought with first impression, my God, what a freak or what an arrogant guy or what a, what a jerk. And to try to look and find out what part or aspect of them or their craft made me think about what I was maybe lacking in myself. I got some practical things and ideas. I have some um, things I want to go think about a little bit more. So my suggestion is that whenever you try to give a feedback to somebody, don't just say you're a bad person. Say that you're, a ba you're not good and this because that and that and give them a solution what they can do to improve it. And I think one of the themes I'm kind of seeing here is creating a movement or you know making bigger changes. What are we trying to do? But it's not the big things. It's the small things. To challenge ideas and to discuss ideas, conceptual ideas in a Hegelian dialectic point counterpoint or to dialectically to, to, to take for the advocate of the devil begging the question just to try and challenge an idea. Yeah, I've been known to do that and, and I'll continue to do it as long as I live probably because that's how I learned. <laughs>